Okay, so now we've done drums, bass, percussion tracks, and vocals. We're gonna move into guitars. Today's worship and praise uh, music contains quite a bit of guitar parts, and uh, what I encounter more often than not with a lot of um, ministries and engineers is they often try to put their guitars up so loud to hear them, uh, and they forget about the fact that guitars live right in the 2K range, which is where the human ear hears the most uh, and is more sensitive. Uh, which translates into people saying the mixes are too loud when if you were to use a meter they may not actually be as loud. So what we want to do with our guitars is find a way to control them, get them nice and present in the mix but without killing people's ears so that they're not distracted and they can worship. The way to do this is to bring guitars to level and then push them up while you're sound checking and get them to not hurt. It's an easy trick and often you'll find that you're pulling out 2.2, 2.5, uh, 2K, real tight, just to get rid of some of that. So what I'm gonna try and do is articulate a little bit of that uh, now for you. So you can hear quite quickly those frequencies that hurt. Right there, right? If that's in every single guitar you've got, it's gonna hurt people. People are not gonna be thrilled. So let's try and control that. Give it back. Holy, holy is the Lord. See that? Huh. There you go. I can get the guitar louder if I want to now. Put it back in. Kind of hurts a little. Still sounds like a guitar. Still sounds great, right? Let's go ahead and uh, give some sparkle back. About 5k. Give it some space for some other instruments. There we go. 